Uh, this is the Italian Culture Club. I'm Chris Capaldo. I'm one of the presidents of it. And I'll tell you a little bit about what we do. Over here is our poster board. It's a bit outdated, but most of it still stands. If you look over here, you see what we need. It's Mondays at the one and two, Mr. Palazzo's room at 2.45. Now, I know that interferes with some of your sports, but that's okay. We're here around, and we're always accepting fall, winter, or spring seasons. In the center of the board, you get to see a little bit about what we do. We like to indulge in the Italian cultural, some Italian-American foods, some Italian foods, some films as well. Over here, you see our moderators, Mr. Malazzo and Ms. Smith. You can talk to them if you have any interest in joining. And if you come down here, this is where actually my favorite part is. You see that we take ships during the year. One to New York. New Haven is outdated. We actually go to Boston. We go to Arthur Avenue and Boston, both of them once a year. And we like to um, embrace the Italian culture. That is there. Uh, this is Fairfield Connections. I'm Michael Klein. I'm a freshman of it. Basically, you work with special needs kids once every month at the end of the month on a Friday for two hours, and you play sports and games with them. And it's a good way to connect with uh, special needs kids and help them out. This is the Habitat for Humanity Club. Habitat for Humanity is a nonprofit organization that our club works with. The organization helps to build homes for those in need. Our club is a great way to be involved in our community and give back to our community. Uh, so this is the Fairfield Prep Environmental Club. My name is Brendan Angle. I'm one of the co-presidents. You know, basically, we're working to make our school a greener place. We, uh, we do a lot of projects. We do some, some small stuff, like a beach cleanup. We're also um, we're working to do some bigger projects, too. Like We're looking at a lot of like uh, solar power and all that types of things. And the more medium things, like composting, making like a lunchroom, some like more biodegradable type of stuff. We're basically making make the school like a greener place. Follow the Jesuit lab, Cena Environmental P. Yeah. I'm Matt Marsvik, and this is Spanish Honor Society. We're a club that focuses on practicing and learning Spanish and immersing ourselves in Spanish culture. We do monthly trips to Caroline House in Bridgeport, where we volunteer with young students from Hispanic communities. We practice our Spanish and we help them with English. Uh, this is Blue Ben. Uh, my name is Kevin Brennan. Uh, I am a student leader on the We are a performing group. We play at both the winter and spring concerts at press. Um, it's a it's inclusive uh, venue. So we, uh, we jam on Mondays right after school from 2.45 to 3.30. All are welcome. And then on uh, Thursday at 6 p.m. Um, we prep for the concert. So how many of you have to play the guitar, the bass, or the drums? Um, it's a fun way to hang out with friends, uh, learn some new stuff, and uh, play with friends. Hi, I'm Coach Kaminsky. I'm a senior. Uh, I'm the, one of the leaders of the team club at Fairfield Prep. Uh, what we do is we do trips every uh, winter. Uh, this year we're going to go to JP for a weekend trip. Uh, it's super fun. Uh, we have a lot of our classmates and friends at the hotel room. It's awesome. sometime in November, where we raise money for charity in Ireland. In the winter, we go to the St. Patrick's Day Parade in Bridgeport. We march in that. Then in the spring, we play Gaelic football, where we practice once a week, and then we finish the season with a game against another team. So if you're interested in any of that, you should definitely sign up for the Irish Hello, I'm Evan Chang. I'm a co-leader of Brains. Brains is an acronym for respect, education, and inclusion for me and our other students. Every Friday, we meet and we have a student discuss a topic related to LGBTQ. Uh, usually, it's news, history, or culture, or uh, like a major figure that helps the community. And then we open it up for discussion. And that's that. Hi, I'm Will Quincy with the Prep Players. It's the theater club here at, uh, at Prep. What we do is we do a fall play and a spring musical. Uh, these are some of our past shows here uh, from Urinetown, which is my freshman year. Uh, this year, for the fall show, we're doing Pops. So, uh, audition September 7th. My name's Robbie Vance, and this is my own. We meet every Tuesday from 2.30 to 3.30 in Mr. Nephew's room. And Ryan's going to tell you a little bit about it. So what we do in Model UN, at the start, we take a set topic, usually based around current political events, and we talk about it in our sessions, and 
everybody is assigned a certain group, country, or person, depending on how big or small the topic is. And what we do is we talk about it, we go around for a few sessions, and we try to reach a certain end goal. And once that end goal is reached, which can be many things depending on what subject that we're doing, then we finish, model you what is done, and we start up again next week with a new topic. Um, Model One also offers uh, many trips, three trips every year. We go to uh, UConn, we go to Boston College, and we go to Yale. Uh, at these trips, uh, you can go with a few students across the world to um, decide on uh, these resolutions, the same resolution in the class, but we do that with other students across the world. Uh, my name is Tim Wong. I'm the president of the Film and Media Club, and my goal for this year is to entertain as many people at this school as I can. Um, the purpose of the Film and Media Club is to bring engaging content to our students, and I think in the past years we've done our best to do that. And this year, with me as president, I hope we can do it in a way we haven't done it yet before, with new upgraded equipment in the Innovation Center, and with brand new people joining the club tonight. Okay, so this is the trick stuff. Yeah, we do girls, we work with the survey company, Redness and Aid, and we survey land and find measurements. And then at the end of the year, there's a competition. We won for nine years in a row. And we can Hi, uh, this is Andre Borges, senior, class of 2022. I'm Jonathan Straker, class of 2022, senior. And here, we're here with the Prep Bowling Club. Uh, we meet every Tuesday and Thursday in the winter months from about 3 to 6. Uh, we accept all skill levels of bowling. Uh, it's really primarily a fun club. Uh, but last year, we got a little more competitive. We came second in our high school league. And are looking forward to playing at States this season. Uh, if you have any questions about the club, Myself, John, or Mr. Whalen at X206. Uh, hi, I'm Carl Nibros. I'm a sophomore here at Prep, and I'm the president of the African American Cultural Club. Uh, despite what the name implies, the club is open to any uh, student at Prep. And we, 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 at meetings, we discuss current events and historical events, as well as groups, like important groups, people, and uh, yeah, groups of people, yeah, groups of people and events, uh, all relating to black culture. So, anybody who's interested in the topic, or anybody who wants to be a part of the safe space here at Prep in order to feel that greater unity, please, please feel free to join the club. It's also pretty low commitment. It's we meet twice a month. Our first meeting is projected for the third week of September. So feel free to come by and see what see what it's like. Yeah. Uh, hello, I'm Luke Anderson. And I'm Charlie Wright. And we are a part of the stock market club. At the stock market club, you can learn the basics of stocks and how to invest. Also, throughout the year, we, we meet with many professional speakers who can give you insights on how their jobs work and professional advice on how to invest in stocks. Also, throughout the year, we can go into very special topics like cryptocurrency and ETFs, and you can learn the basics to stock, to stock investing and learn how to make money in the future. Yeah, really anyone can join the stock club even if you don't know anything about stocks because we'll teach the basics and we can go for it. through teaching the basics. We'll, take it, uh, we'll teach you more and more complicated things about stocks. Also, um, throughout the year, you are allowed to use this app which simulates the stock market and lets you get some experience in the investing in stocks before you have to invest your actual own money. My name is Nick Walteri, I'm a sophomore here at Prep, and uh, I'm going to be talking to you more about uh, the campus ministry and how to get involved. So, uh, campus ministry meets every uh, Monday after school at X107 for about uh, 10 to 15 minutes. And uh, to get involved, just uh, either sign up or email Mr. Walteri, the director of campus ministry here at Prep. Um, about how to get involved with it's various student retreats, various opportunities, and uh, various ways to just kind of build your relationship with God and get more involved here. Hi, I'm Carlos Lewis. I'm a senior. Uh, I'm in there. I'm a senior. So, Info Peace is a nonprofit organization that uh, started in Ireland. But we go through and it's founded through high school clubs and we unite and strengthen the local communities through basketball. And by refurbishing courts and doing basketball drives, we're uniting communities, spreading the love of basketball. 
So a best example of what we do is this summer, me and another senior, Max Manchos, we were on the news for what we were doing. And uh, we went in the Rucker Park, which is like the most famous court in the world. KD, Kobe, a bunch of other basketball players have played there. And it took a court from looking like this. We made it look like this in a matter of two days. And uh, we just go around the community. That's like the biggest one, but we do as soon as Mohawk and Stanford. Uh, so we meet, we meet when needed during the school year. Uh, it's not really a weekly or monthly thing. It's just whatever is needed. Um, we hold events uh, over the weekend during the school year. Uh, it's usually an all-day thing, but you can just schedule when you want to go. Uh, if you have any questions, you can email me, Connor Lewis, Will McCarthy, Max Mangos, or Tim Spawn. Um, we meet in B105, which is Dr. Schmidt's room, so you can also go to her with questions. Hello, uh, my name is Liam LaFond, and this is Ryan O'Meara, and we are the moderators for the Spike Ball Club. So, in the Spike Ball Club, we are going to play a lot of Spike Ball. Um, we will probably meet in some grassy area around prep to play Spike Ball. Um, if you're not sure of the rules, that's fine. We can teach you if you've never played, or if you're really good, anyone is welcome. Um, we meet on um, Thursdays uh, after school, uh, the Hill Behind School. We accept all skill levels. And we right now we're, we're meeting on Thursdays, but that could change. So if you're unsure or want to know any more information, then just email any one of us at our emails. And our faculty moderator is Mr. Hutchinson. So if you have any other questions, you can find him in the guidance office. Hi, I'm John Reedy, I'm Scouter, and we're the uh, Big Book Craft Debate Club. We meet uh, every Thursday after school at 402, which is Mr. Reedy's room. We can debate everything from Afghanistan to you know, prep, dress code. Uh, you should join your club because you'll learn how to debate a lot, how to argue and make your points. You'll get to debate other prep students, which is always fun. And hopefully, if COVID allows, we can get to go to some, to some uh, bigger debate on the So the public speaking to uh, uh, Hi, uh, I'm James R. Foley. I'm here on behalf of our business club leader, Audrey Mead. And um, basically, the business club, we just we meet every Wednesday for uh, 20 minutes after school. And we, Draft up model businesses and compete against each other to see if that's possible. Hello, same thing. I'm Jessica. And I'm going to be Jess here. I'm going to be Tuesday after school in the next 308. And our co moderator is Mr. White. I am the club president. Come and join. If I'm going to play Jess and learn about it, be welcome anyone. My name is Louis Brio. I moderate the Awareness Society. We meet on Thursdays. We talk about politics. Our moderator is Mr. Denby and Mr. Moritz. It's a really fun time. Yes, yeah, so we also have a writing aspect to our club. We have uh, special editions that we write in response to news. We also have long printed editions. We interview people like Mr. Malasso here. We talk about the intersection of religion and politics. Hi there, this is Eric John Herdeman, uh, leader of the Mental Health Awareness Club, and I founded it back in late 2019. Our mission as a club is essentially to spread the word. As oftentimes in society, people think, oh, mental illness, this is something, you know, it's, it's not real, it's superficial, when in reality, the pandemic amongst other issues in society have created this stigma where all these people and these, they have these issues and it's often overlooked. So our job is basically to give funds, to provide um, support, fundraisers, and provide money to uh, the organizations themselves. This right here is just a brief overview of what we've done so far since 2019 when we started. Um, these are the masks from our $1,600 fundraiser that we created. Uh, and this right here, this, again, is basically the proposal for that fundraiser as well. We also made videos, um, COVID safety procedures, and we've made presentations and sent other sorts of projects out to the school. Uh, we meet um, in X306, it's Mr. Chat. We typically meet on Thursdays from 2.30, right when school gets out, to about 3.15. I'm Sebastian Rodriguez, this is Brendan Manoski, this is the Robotics Club. Basically, we have competitions 
and we build robots to perform certain tasks. And you can join and you can help us build the robot and program it. You don't need to know any experience. We can teach you. And basically, we just go into the group near the end of the year and we compete and try to win a title. There's different types of jobs from programming to designing to actually screwing it on, and no experience is needed.